Hello friends, welcome again to the ETAP lecture series uh, first level and third lecture. In this lecture we will uh, discuss more about the copy project too mainly and we will go furthermore. Uh, let's start. We had already created a new project from new project with the previous discussed uh, and details uh, options which I have already given. Now we mm, are going to uh, focus on the safe project, copy project 2 and safe library and furthermore. In save the project, uh, it will save the project as now common in many other softwares. But in another softwares we have one another option of uh, save as that we can save our file to uh, by another name in another folder maybe maybe by another name or optional to another uh, folders but uh, here in etab we have copy project 2 what's the difference between save save as and copy project 2 in save project it will automatically it will automatically save the project and furthermore we will have the project which is already open in our desktop yeah now in uh, save as when we save as any file we save it in another folder then when we come again our save as folder will be open our save as folder our save as file will be open here but uh, in ethab there is uh, a very important uh, and a uh, very nice option that is copy project 2 in copy project 2 for example we uh, have uh, maybe we have uh, now for example we have uh, this is a single line diagram between two buses. I want only this portion of my project be saved in another name. So what I do uh, is go to project now, open it. I call it as I uh, I give the name of copy mm, copy of couple the first. Uh, uh, file which is a uh, Kabul 2 file now I want to uh, have a copy only a copy of only this much details of my project by another name of copy of Kabul 2 yeah save it Now it's done. Here, uh, now we have our main file, not the copy of Kabul 2. We furthermore, whatever we give another changes in our project. So now I had given a change in my project. Now this is in Kabul 2 file, not copy of Kabul 2. Copy of Kabul 2 is only this much of details only about two buses and one line uh, between the bullets uh, now we had known the copy of project 2 uh, if you think that uh, mm, in save as file we save the file in any other folder by another name but uh, uh, when we open the, the main file, uh, the, the save as file will be opened, not the our saved file. Now we understood about the save, save as, and copy project too. The next we go to the save library. In save library, we have uh, also here save library, 
another save we have in the library menu here save and save as uh, library we know that for example I added this cable uh, each cable produced by uh, any industry has different uh, specifications so according to the industries according to the manufacturers uh, we select the uh, cable here uh, it means we are associating our uh, equipments and elements uh, to the um, already manufactured uh, elements in the industries with different specifications that is the libraries now um, when I add uh, uh, the type of this cable from the library cables now we, I save it or maybe I add uh, another you know, library to my system uh, external li library myself defined library from another uh, uh, new uh, industry uh, elements library to my system so uh, what I do I save in the library menu but whenever we want to save the entire library associated to this project not associated to only one element or a specified a library if I want to uh, save the entire libraries of my project I save from save library the next is about the print setup it prints the data and the project and here we uh, need to uh, give some setups this is the name of the printer and here the properties of the printer we have uh, how to uh, uh, give the specifications of uh, the printed uh, datas and the printed file now uh, here no more thing is very very important and technical all are simple as other software simple Microsoft softwares maybe uh, this is a, uh, a PDF specification that it, we want to pr uh, print on and settings are you know, high quality print PDF and smallest file size and standards um, we have option of black gray and color and another resolution I selected the resolution maybe in some of the projects our uh, images are very small and it required to be uh, printed very clearly so I increased the resolution uh, before myself uh, this is about the layout mm, about the uh, document information we can add here on the PDF the information on the PDF this is a little different about the project mm, file project is any tab file this is a printed PDF file so I can give titles and information to the documents title subject author keywords and creators the next is about um, it gives little specifications about the printers and all uh, furthermore it is uh, we, we select the size of the uh, printed file uh, the source portal uh, then in landscape type or portrait type now done the next uh, portion is about the print preview it previews how my data will be printed it would be printed like this so furthermore uh, when our lectures goes uh, further step up we will discuss how to manage this uh, printed data and come back in escape press the escape button and came back now in a file 
we have the print to print it then uh, in the print option here we have the uh, printing entire diagram the selected elements only uh, the options of course and uh, which pages uh, print quality uh, we select from here number of copies this is set up is uh, exactly the same as the uh, uh, print setup and uh, here are options about um, in one line a diagram uh, print options uh, whether only my uh, AC elements be printed or DC elements which type of elements OLA objects should only be printed I can uh, click on and uh, text boxes be printed or not uh, we select from here and print uh, de-energized elements only maybe and sometimes we have uh, we open one project and we uh, print only de-energized elements um, or maybe sometimes we select only and selected elements and header and footer uh, related to our company we select here and then we click OK done now it's going uh, gonna be printed in PDF file here and we save by the name of Kabul to file this PC maybe now it is saved here we have another uh, very important uh, option in uh, the print uh, section we have batch print batch print it prints uh, whatever the networks uh, diagrams uh, that we require uh, to be printed it's uh, going to print it according to our selection uh, whether all the components together be uh, printed uh, or some of the equipments all together only a uh, few sections be out of the print we select here from here and furthermore we go to the exchange data for the next level